Solve for x. Now you can see x plus 5, x plus 7 are the bases. So what can we do? Complicated. Now, the best thing is substitution. And the best choice is to substitute x plus 6. Their mean. If we let it be t, then x plus 5 will be t minus 1, x plus 7 will be t plus 1. So here, t minus 1 to the power 4, and here is t plus 1 to the power 4, 272. 4 is just 2 times 2, so this guy is t minus 1 squared, then squared. This as well. t minus 1 all squared is t squared plus 1 minus 2t. t plus 1 all squared is t squared plus 1 plus 2t. Now you can see, here minus 2t, here plus 2t, t squared plus 1, t squared plus 1. So we can substitute again. If we let this be a, this be b. That means t squared plus 1 is a, 2t is b. So now, the left hand side will be a minus b squared plus a plus b squared. How shall I simplify this? Not hard. a squared minus 2ab plus b squared plus a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Now you can see minus 2ab plus 2ab cancelled. So this is just a squared plus a squared plus b squared plus b squared. That is 2 times a squared plus b squared. Very good. So that means the left hand side is just 2 times t squared plus 1 all squared plus 2t all squared is 272. This is t to the power 4 plus 2t squared plus 1, and this is 4t squared. Divide 2 on the both sides, it is 1, 3, 6. So now this equation is an equation about t or t squared, because t to the power 4 plus 6t squared minus 135 equals 0. It is actually an equation about t squared, and the left hand side can be factorized. t squared, t squared, minus 135 can be written as, it is negative 15 times 9 or 15 times negative 9. 15 times negative 9 is good. Because then negative 9 plus 15 is 6. Very good. So that means this is just t squared minus 15, uh, plus 15, sorry, then times t squared minus 9 equals 0. So there are two cases first case and the second case. In our first case, t squared plus 15 equals 0. What can we get? t squared equals negative 15. So no real solutions. However, complicated solutions or imaginary solutions there are. In our second case, t squared minus 9 equals 0. So t squared is 9. So that means t is 3 or negative 3. Then we can find out the value of x. x is t minus 6. So x1 is 3 minus 6, 
is negative 3. And x2 is negative 3 minus 6, negative 9. Of course, also the other imagined solutions, negative 6 plus or minus square root of 15 times i. Did you get them? Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to me for more wonderful questions. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.